students everywhere are affected by stuff like this. And there are students in high school who decide not to go on to college just because of how disastrous their high school was, because of just how bullied they were. Before, students could go home and not have to be surrounded by that, but now with things like cyberbullying, like, it's almost like there's nowhere for a student to feel safe anymore. Every student deserves a safe place. At GLSEN, the Gay, Lesbian, Straight Education Network, they strive to assure that every member of the school community feels safe and valued, regardless of their sexual orientation, gender expression, or identity. My kid just recently dealt with some, um, some bullying in school and, had, and there was a very good system in place already, thankfully, where uh, we were able to talk not only uh, to the teacher that was in the class, but also to the principal who act, reacted very quickly. It's happening all the time. I find that um, when they're there, they're in survival mode when they're at school. And that is, that's really not cool because you're, you're always thinking, okay, you know, how can I get through the next period? Or she's actually developed a method where she's on the bus with her iPod on so that she, she doesn't have to hear any kind of derogatory language or anything. And it's, it's really not cool at all. As bullying has become an increasing problem throughout the nation, there are more and more places where students can turn for help. One of them is GLSEN. GLSEN is a national organization that started in the mid-1990s and because of um, one teacher whose student came and said, I don't feel safe at school, I need somebody to talk to, I need some support, I need some help, um, and I want you to do something about it. Our main purpose is to make schools safe for all students, not just lesbian, gay, trans, bisexual students, but um, we found that having, uh, being a presence in schools makes all students feel safer, whether or not they're tall or short or are African American or Muslim or agnostic or whatever. So it, although our focus is on lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender students, we found that all students feel safer because of the attitude that schools have who are anti-bullying and um, who are supportive of all students and want all students to be safe to learn and to be who they are. I think measures taken inside the school by its students are stronger than any organization. Mainly informing and being acknowledged is the best thing that Glessing can do. However, individuals are the strongest part of any organization. There are two GLSEN chapters in Maine which have the job of overseeing more than 55 gay, straight, trans alliances. Throughout the year, they sponsor events to help spread awareness and incite action. This includes Ally Week in October, Transgender Remembrance Day in November, a Day of Silence in April, and No Name Calling Week in January. They also conduct educational trainings and workshops and speak to Maine legislators to raise public awareness for LGBT youth issues. What do you hope people take away from those sort of events? Um, a better understanding of just what other students face um, because I don't think that all students necessarily are fully aware of the bullying in their schools and um, which students have a lot that they go through and it's certainly understandable but you know it could be your brother who's getting bullied and not know anything and an event like this could help you be more aware. According to a National School Climate Survey, more than 61% of students felt unsafe at school because of their sexual orientation, and nearly a third skipped school in the past month because they felt unsafe. It's just about making schools uh, safe. It's, there's no particular agenda or anything, and you know, if you want to come, then come, and we'll welcome you no matter what. Like, you don't have to be lesbian or gay or bisexual or transgendered. You can be straight, you can be any political party, you can be any religion, and you'll still be welcome. People all around the world are fighting for their human rights. Um, uh, lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender students um, need to have the same, they're not rights, they're just, they're human rights. They're not special rights, they're human rights. And there's kids who don't even know a gay kid who feel that it's really important that all, all people be able to be who they are and to be accepted and safe and be able to learn and be happy and be able to, you know, um, achieve whatever they want to achieve in life. It hits at the very core of who we are as Americans, our best part of who we are as Americans. Want to know more about GLSEN? Log on to their website. There's a link on myfoxmain.com.